Welcome to today's Godly Play Story. This is the third Sunday of Easter. We are still celebrating the mystery that Jesus died and that God made him alive again. Let's begin with our greeting. Remember, it's new. I will say, the Lord has risen, and you will say, Christ has risen indeed. So let's try that. The Lord has risen. Christ has risen indeed. Let's sing our Getting Ready song. Be still. Please sing with us. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Today's story is called The Great Banquet. I wonder if this is a parable. Hmm, it might be. Parables are very precious, like gold, and this box is gold. This looks like a present. Parables are like presents. They have already been given to us. We can't buy them, or take them, or steal them. They are already ours. There's another reason why this might be a parable. It has a lid. And sometimes parables seem to have lids on them. But when you lift the lid of a parable, there's something very precious inside. I know. Let's take off the lid and see if this is a parable. I wonder what this could be. It's so green. It's shaped like a square. It could be a blanket or a rug. Let's see if there's more. Hmm. This looks like a table. Once there was someone who said such amazing things and did such wonderful things that people began to follow him. As they followed, he told them about a kingdom, the kingdom of heaven. But they did not understand. They had never been to such a place, and they didn't know anyone who had. So one day he said, the kingdom of heaven is like this. Once a person invited many people to a great feast. When the feast was ready, the servant said to the guests, Come, for all is now ready. But they all made excuses. The first said, I just bought a field, and I have to go and see it. Please excuse me. Another said, I just bought five yoke of oxen, and I have to go and try them out. Please excuse me. Still another said, I just got married, so I cannot come. Please excuse me. When the servant told his master, he said, Go quickly to the streets and alleys of the city, and bring in the poor. 
the crippled, and the blind. But still, there was room. Go out to the highways and roads and get people to come so my house will be filled. I wonder how it felt to be invited to this great feast. I wonder if these people have names. I wonder why these people came and the others wouldn't. I wonder how the master feels about the guests. I wonder how the guests feel about the master. I wonder how many could really be at this table. I wonder if you have ever been near a table like this. I wonder where this table might really be.